Let me tell you something. Every day you're going to have to make a great decision. And you might not think of it as so great at the time. But every day that decision is going to determine your future. Because see, some people think a great decision is saying no to drugs. And yes, that is important. And some people might be saying no to alcohol. Yes, that is important. But I'm going to tell you another great decision you got to make every day. And it is a decision of the path that you're going to choose to walk down. You have to make that great decision every day. Am I going to hang out with this crowd, that crowd? Is this crowd going in the direction that's going to better my future? Every day can determine what your future is going to be like simply by saying no to some bad choices, bad decisions that will take you to a place you don't want to go, keep you longer than you want to stay. And let me tell you, it'll cost you more than you want to spend. It's time today to start making great decisions. Choose the people you want to go with. You can't be an eagle if you're hanging out with crows. Eagles are not afraid to soar alone. Eagles are not afraid to say no. I'm not going with the flow. I'm going to soar above. And today is the first day of the rest of your life. You're going to make a decision today. And whether you like it or not, you're going to give a testimony of how you're an overcomer, how you're a great achiever, or how you're done under. You're tore up from the floor up. The choice is yours to make. What choice is it going to be? When you leave here today, will you quickly forget everything that was told to you? Will you take it seriously? Or are you already in trouble and making wrong decisions? Some of you today won't be here next year. Some of you here today won't make it to graduation. Some of you here today are not going to see next week because you're already in a bad place. You're already in trouble and nobody even knows about it because you're good at hiding your pain, your addiction, your wrong decisions. But today could be a great decision that you make to change your tomorrow by changing your today and choosing not to go down that path anymore. And if you're needing help, there's people here today that will help you. There's people here that can help you make that great decision for a better tomorrow. It's like a flat tire. You ain't going nowhere till you fix it. Are you hearing what I'm saying? Do you understand the gravity of that flat tire? You can't go to Disneyland. You can't go on vacation. And no, you're not leaving the country. You got a flat tire. And until you deal with your problem and fix it, your future is done. And guess what? That is another great decision you're going to have to make. I'm Pastor Joe Romero, evangelist. To those who feel like nobody cares, I want to tell you God has not given up on you and neither do I. I want to tell you that one man with the fire of God can do more than a thousand ministers. I don't care what plaques you got on the wall. Make a decision to go forward with God and not go with the crowd, not go pick up the crack pipe. Don't pick up that bottle that's gonna leave you hung over and tore up from the floor up. You're such a mess, how can you think of success? It starts by getting rid of the stinking thinking. You're a great, de you're a great decision away from making a choice that will change your tomorrow and the year after, the month after, It'll change you forever if you just learn the principle of making a great decision. Do it today and let's follow up. Let's not be a one-time wonder, oh, I, I came to hear the evangelists today. No, this is part of a series that will transform your life because making a great decision is one thing, acting upon it is another, and having safeguards in place is something you got to do every day. Are you willing to bulletproof your future? Are you willing to make sure that the enemy don't take you down, even if it means setting up some parameters, parameters and safeguards that keep you from self-sabotaging your own destiny? Some of you.